Welcome back, guys. It's Friday, so you know we are learning with McKernan here in the studio today. And Matt, today you're talking to us about the fact that gardening kind of changes as our climate or our soil or our world changes. And you want to help people stay up to date or get prepared to stay up to date on some of those things. Absolutely. If we just look at the last few months, there's been a lot of crazy weather in Kansas. The last couple of days we were near record highs across the state, but just two weeks ago we were setting new records for lows across the state. Yeah. Uh, you think about the droughts we've experienced the last few years compared to the amount of wet that we've had. And even if you look long term at some of these updated USDA zone hardiness maps we talked about a few weeks ago, the averages across the United States for at least half the country have shifted from about five degrees to 10 degrees warmer than they were in the last 30 years than previously 10 years ago when we looked at those same 30 year averages. And clearly that's going to affect uh, what we plant, how we mm -hmm. garden around here. And especially our long term plants, our perennials, our shrubs, but especially our trees that we want to survive for tens, even hundreds of years in the landscape. We really want to make sure that we're adapting our landscaping practices and our plant selection to be looking forward at what the, the future brings for all of these extreme climate um, changes that we could be experiencing. And you guys have a, an amazing expert to help our people at home that want more information on this. We do. We're really excited for our K-State Garden Hour webinar series this next Wednesday, February 7th. We have a world-renowned speaker and Nobel Pri Peace Prize winner, actually, who's going to be talking about gardening for a changing climate. We actually have Dr. Charles Rice, who is a K-State professor and distinguished professor in soil microbiology. He's going to be giving this presentation because not only is he an expert in climate change and carbon cycles and in soil microbiology, he's also a hobby gardener, so he gets it and uh, is really going to be sharing with us his expertise on how we can adapt everything from our soil health to our watering practices to our plant selection to really help us be successful and, and protect our gardens long term into the future. And if Matt, we want to get on and see this and to learn all these things, mm -hmm. what's the best way to do that? So the easiest thing you can do is search K-State Garden Hour online. You can also visit our website directly, ksre-learn.com slash K-State Garden Hour. Um, and, and really, you can register for this free webinar. It's going to be live from noon to one next Wednesday, but it's also recorded. So if you can't join us during that time, you can catch the recording that's posted on that same website right afterwards about the following day. And it's a really great opportunity because, again, it's not going to cost you anything. Um, and it's a great way to stay up to date on all of the latest research and really tips for what you can do to have more success in your in your garden to come. And this is not the only webinar you guys do. No, we have a new webinar topic every Wednesday or every first Wednesday of every month. And so if, if this isn't your topic that you're interested in, uh, we've got a lot of great other ones playing that you can find online as well. Totally free, easy to access, and you do not have to watch it live. As Matt said, they do record yep. them so you can go back and watch ones you've missed as well. All right, well, thank you, Matt. We always appreciate it. Yep.